So you did those sentences and you were worried. You were sitting there not wanting to do them. But you, but you did them. You were sitting there and you didn't want to do your sentences. Mm-mm. But you did them. All by yourself. See? Isn't that cool, Jim? You excited? Mm -hmm. Jim, uh-uh. <laughs> Are you proud? Uh, yeah. You proud of yourself? Mm -hmm. I'm good. You are all done. Just look at that hurricane. Seems a red thing. Yeah, there's another hurricane. Wait. Oh, that one's bigger. It's called Hurricane Matthew. What? Yes, the hurricane has a name. Called Hurricane Matthew. Hurricanes are very dangerous. Okay. okay. Anybody who lives over here has to move up that way. Yeah, why? What sort of storm won't get them? There's gonna be too much water coming at you. Water? It's very dangerous. You could die. You don't get out of the way of the hurricane, it can come get you. And that's uh, not. Mm hmm. It's very dangerous. It's gonna be too much rain and too much wind. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Come here, Raya. Uh-uh. It's the same here again. Okay. He's hitting up that way, okay? Okay. There's a computer showing us where her head is going. Okay. Mm -hmm. Georgia. Hmm? It's not showing Georgia yet. It's cut off. Oh. It's just showing Florida. Mm -hmm. Jam, stop. <laughs> Enough. Mm -hmm. well, hurricane's nowhere near us. Mm -hmm. Only people in Florida have to move. Jam, stop. Enough. You're annoying. For now, only people in Florida have to move somewhere else, okay? Okay. It's going to come in there, blow their homes over, and flood them out. Too much water in the wind. Mm -hmm. Lots and lots of rain and heavy wind. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm-
don't break stuff. Hurry up. Over jam. Hmm. What the? Oh well, mommy life. Oh, I have a few calls to make, so done with that. And it's already um time for food. It's twelve fifteen. Um so you use it right now I'm just chilling. <laughs> Cause I'm exhausted already. Um, like I said, Kayana, she's gonna be waking up in a little while for her bottle. Sometimes I like to wake her up before she gets up, but I'm just gonna wait till she starts crying. I have to um, go through Saran Jam's um, notebooks and refill what I, whatever I need to refill in here. I know Soraya, I might have given her some stuff ahead of time. But let's see if I did or not. I don't remember. Oh, nope. It's time for me to add some more work. So lately we've been doing more of this type of subtraction. She's in second grade now. She's pretty much expressed a huge interest in um, double digit math now. So that's what we're working on. It says she did her sentences today. She was kind of struggling with sentences completely. But I've been trying to boost her up in that and have her read a lot. And of course, reading also helps. Reading definitely helps with sentences. Because if you don't read, how are you going to know how to form sentences? She's been doing definitions. Um, with our children's dictionary. But yeah, today she did that. What else we've been working on lately? Just reviewing. I've been having to review the planets, the senses, and the seasons. These are things we do repeatedly, like every week. Um, ABC order. Counting. Um, coin values. You've been working on coin values. Been doing that with both of them. And she has pretty much, well, I'm not sure if she memorized it yet. We're working on it. Working on that and money, stuff like that. More subtraction. Use those definitions, the definitions to the words that she just put in a sentence. So I give her a new spelling list every week. Every week there's a new spelling list with new words where we go over them like the whole week. We do the review because that's pretty much what I did in school and I don't see the harm in, you know, kind of doing a similar um, process because it helps you learn the words and even at the end of the month I'll go back over all the words that she did that um, they both did the whole month. And we review but it's pretty much um, three times each then we define the words then we, um, no wait three times each, then ABC order, then definitions, and then, um, one more, oh yeah, sentences. 
and pretty much on Friday I just review, review the words with them, make sure they know how to spell them. Pretty much like a spelling test, without calling it a test, or not necessarily, you know, in a harsh way, rather. Like how, about how testing was done in school. Um, I give them like an oral test, and I give them a written test to see if they know how to spell the words. And that's usually fun, so I love spelling. They both love spelling, which is awesome. So that's pretty much what we've been doing. That's pretty much how I've been homeschooling them. Um, you know, I tend to switch it up every few months. You've been doing more Spanish. Because I know a good bit of Spanish, and I'm ashamed of myself for not teaching them more Spanish sooner. <laughs> but we're working on it. We're getting there. And like I said, this is stuff we do all the time. That's three times each. So with Soraya, I've been teaching her about nouns and verbs. And Spanish counting, telling time. Just a bunch of various things. But, like I said, there are a lot of things that we do every week. Every week we review pretty much the same thing so that they don't forget. Just critical. Stuff like that. She loves that. Um, yeah, last, um, two weeks ago we were doing measurements. We were doing a lot of measurements. I was showing her about inches and centimeters on a ruler. <sighs> yeah, a lot of stuff. But again, I need to, um, need to update some stuff in there. It's time for me to do that. And the jam's pretty much the same thing. <laughs> is when he does his little punishment ratings. I pretty much put it in the same notebook. Because it doesn't matter to me. Let's see. Does he have anything left? Do I have to update his? Nope. I have to do both of them. Wonderful. So I'm going to do that. Yeah. I'm going to fill in some more review things with my um, trusty red pen here. Doesn't matter, usually I just alternate between pens when I give them work, so it's not Monday yet, but I'm going to have to find them a new spelling list. Um, I have spelling lists saved on my computer as examples of new words to give them, so I'll get on that. And yeah, wait, today's Thursday, isn't it? Oh crap. Yeah, we don't homeschool on Friday. I give myself a break <laughs> because I need it. I give myself a break on Thursdays. I mean, on Fridays. So yeah, tomorrow and Saturday, and Sunday, I'm going to be off from homeschooling. I take a break on the weekends, like the traditional um, schooling way, just because I need a break too. I'm not going to give them schoolwork the entire week. Friday, Saturday, Sunday are my days off from homeschooling. And um it gives me time to, you know, get them ready for the next week. And then like I said, I have time now to prepare. Write in their notebooks and prepare. And I can also um go through their, you know, whatever workbooks I want them to go to um work in. I can prepare for that. I have yet to have sorry I work in this. I know I talked about this vi this uh, workbook in another video and I haven't done it with her yet, but I will. I will get on it very soon. So I said by homeschooling is a lot of preparation. And these workbooks. I need to um ah, see what's what's next in here for Soraya. Consonants. Okay, Q words are next. It's P, Q. Okay, I forgot this book goes in order. So she's doing very well in this workbook here. With like sentence, sen sentence fill-ins. She's doing very well. In fact, I think Jam can also work in one of these. I gave them both to her at the time because... You know, it seems like not on her level. Jim is learning very quickly. 
So he can very well at least do one of these. I think. I'm not too sure. I have to test him. <laughs> he reads well, but concepts like word searches and crossword puzzles, I'm not really sure if he's ready for yet. I'm not too sure, but like I said, I will see. There is no harm in trying. Absolutely no harm. I like my kids to be ahead of the game if possible. So, yeah. I will see. I'm going to um, see if he can, you know, work on that. Oh, they're updating the storm tracker again. And the thing is acting up. I go crap. The um the hurricane disappeared. <laughs> As if it could just disappear like just like that. Anyway, yeah. I need to organize this shelf again because it's a mess. I have homeschool stuff everywhere. Which is fine. Usually Jam's pile is right here. Sarai's pile is here and Samari stuff is over mixed in and bunch of random stuff. In fact, this is some more. It shouldn't even be there. Wrong place for it. But I'm gonna do some more later. I'm gonna have her come out and do some writing and counting. So, yeah. Oh, this is her utensil box. Lots of stuff in there. Pencils and um, I'm gonna chill right now. I'm sleepy. I'm very sleepy. Like I said, Kayana is... It. Here she goes. She's gonna be up in a minute, so I'm gonna, um, probably get ready to make her bottle and feed her. And like I said, I'm going to redo or refresh their... do their work for next week. I don't have to get that all done today, but I'd rather get it all done today so my weekends can be totally free. Yeah. That's how I like it. And then I have some housework. I still haven't, I haven't done the dishes yet. I have not done the dishes yet, but I'll get on it. This is my day. It's pretty much my everyday routine. Yeah. Oh, wow. So they changed the way this hurricane looks up here. I don't know what happened to the big red um, image. I don't know if that means the hurricane kind of simmered down a bit or not, but either way, it's still there and it's heading for Florida big time. So anybody in Florida, I hope y'all are evacuating and being safe. Y'all stay safe. I know everybody's going to be flooding where I am in Georgia. <laughs> everybody's going to be coming this way. Okay. I just did a little workout. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you have me getting back on my working out. I just did like a mini one because technically I am... I'm hungry again. I am hungry. But I'm not like super hungry, so what I'm gonna do right now that I do sometimes is have some tea. I'm gonna have some tea. This little kettle thing. Um I've been drinking coffee lately, but I don't feel like having coffee right now. So I'm going to make some tea. Let's see, which tea do I want? I have so many teas in here left over from um, before I got pregnant. Most of these teas I couldn't drink during pregnancy. Not that one, but stuff like this. Yeah, I was not able to drink that oh. during pregnancy. Not this detox one. So I might have that one. I 
got so many. What's this one? Oh, this is regular chamomile. I got that for my pregnancy. I didn't, still didn't drink much of it. Oh, so many. I still have this one. I got that energy one. I have Stress relief one. I have another one back there somewhere. I need to drink these. Goodness gracious. I have this one, but I know with this tea, I need to be eating well too. And I have not been eating well just yet. Um, I'm going to have to start over on that when I go to the store in a few days. This one has a lot of organic herbs and stuff. Drink up to 10 tea bags a day. What? There ain't no way in hell I'm going to drink 10 tea bags a day. I mean, who would do that? Is it that serious? Uh-uh. I mean, they're serious. They're serious. Of course, if I recall, this stuff kind of made my stomach act up a little bit because it was detoxing. I don't see how in the world anyone would want to drink like several cups of tea. Like, several. Like, over two. <laughs> I mean, I know people drink like two cups of coffee, but that's normal. Okay, two cups of coffee. What you want here? People drinking over two cups of tea. Maybe I'm wrong. Y'all tell me. Y'all drink over. Y'all drink more than two cups of tea at a time. <laughs> I sure don't. There's no. Re I don't see a reason. Um. But hey, that's you. Then go ahead. Go right on ahead. But ten. Ten. Mm -mm. Yeah. Like I said, I did my little mini workout. I did like some little bit of ab work. All I just did was like um. You'll know how exercise with you. I don't know what you call it, but you pretty much take your elbows and you go down to your knees like that. Whatever you call those, where you pretty much touch the opposite elbow to the opposite knee. I did a few of those. Oh my gosh, they hurt. Those hurt like hell. But they work my abs. It's um pretty much an easy exercise and it works my abs very well. So I did some of those and now my abs are burning, which is great. I'm gonna get back on my cardio soon and I'll be back outside jumping rope like I did last year. Y'all remember that? Y'all remember last year I was jumping rope? Yeah, I'm gonna get back on that. Just um probably not this morning because I didn't because I'm filming this video, I didn't actually get around to doing it. But like I said, I will do that. Make that part of my routine again, my daily routine. So yeah. Working out is fun. Although I wish I had somebody to work out with and I wish I could go to a gym so I could have a wider range of things to do. However, that's not the case. It's not really the case. So I just do what I can from home. You can still work out from home. Doing you can still have an effective workout from home. So Yeah. Looks like I can always do a workout DVD. That I downloaded. I pretty much download these things for free, or I look on YouTube because I don't have the money to buy any um any of Sean T's Insanity or anything like that. <clears throat> don't have the money for any of that, so I just either I look online or I just download it for free somewhere because they're up everywhere for free, pretty much in a lot of places. So that's what I do for workouts. And like I said, I'm gonna get back on my jump over again because that really helped. That's a total body workout, like total body. I was, you know, dropping pounds quickly when I was jumping rope. I love it. I'm trying to prepare them for next week. Yeah. Trying to prepare them for next week. Yeah. Since it's already Thursday. Mm. Look at the Kayana! Chilling out. <laughs> Her eyes are crossed. Oh, hey, baby girl.
You're still barely eating. Well, you ate the applesauce. You're done. Let go. Let go. Eat something else. Stuff your mouth, boy. Open your mouth. Open. Open your mouth. Oh. Eat. <laughs> Close your mouth now. Damn, come on now. Let's go. Eat. You now way too slow. Come on. Right on the cards. Okay. Okay. What you doing, Tori? Hmm? Sharpen. That thing is too small. You might as well not even try to sharpen that. That thing's tiny. It's gonna get stuck in there. Uh. <laughs> what? It's so small, it's gonna get stuck. It was just stuck, but I got it out. You gotta be careful. It's gonna get super stuck. Super. How? It's going to get, get smaller like the rest of them. Mama! Goodness, wow. Oh, well, keep sharpening it if you think it's not going to get stuck. I'm just warning you. What, Mari? I was trying to make a five. Good. Oh, you need to get to your schoolwork in a minute. Actually, am I wrong? It doesn't matter. Oh. It equals nine. Mm -hmm. Your time is up, Jam. Let's go. Everybody done beat you ten times over when you go over there goofing off. Come on. Stop giggling. Boy, this troll. Uh, no, it was in your hand. Uh uh. Eat that. Mm -hmm. Eat a little boy. Hey, darling, Alani boy. Diana. Hey, little baby Diana. <laughs> no, you got the foot. Cute. Look at the adorableness. Scrub, boy. You didn't have to move the toaster. Put that back. Thank you. Out. Oh. oh, yeah. I'm glad you remember to put those back. Keep going. B C D E F G H I J. Mm -hmm. 
What does A say? A. What does B say? B. What does C say? Mm. Don't look at the computer. What does C say? Mm. Cool. What does D say? D. Good girl. What does E say? E. Mm hmm. E. What does F say? F. Good girl. What does G say? J. Good. Good. What does H say? <gasps> Yay. What does I say? E. What does I say? Look at me. What does I say? E. 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 What about J? E. E. J. J. Like jam. Right? Yeah. J. Mommy. <laughs> now I want you to write them. Look. What? <gasps> Ooh, it's your nice shiny pencil. Nice pointy pencil. Mm hmm I want you to write. Nice and neat, okay? Yeah. No, it needs to be bigger than that. Write yeah. it as big as that one. That's not big enough. Start from the bottom, go all the way up to that line. Good. You write your lowercase a. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. What are you doing? Yeah, you, need, you need that. Write your lowercase a. Now across. Yay! You did it. I did a little one. Go, a little more. Go, a little more. Go. Mm-mm, down. Put that line down. Good. Keep going. Yeah. You did it. Wow. <gasps> you did all those letters, Rory, by yourself. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> Tomorrow you have more tracing. <gasps> what? Uh -huh. That's not for now, though, okay? Let's tell you his date. Let's spell your name. X Y M A R I. Mm -hmm. Spell your last name. O W E What's that? N. Mm -hmm. X. Good. Yay. That was a bat. Look, that's how you spell bat. Look. B. What's that? A. P. Good. That's how you spell bat. B. B. A. A. T. T. Bat. Say bat. Bat. Good girl. Now which one of these things start with B? 
Uh, Which one of these pictures? B. Good. Circle it. What is that? Uh, I don't think that starts to be. I think it's supposed to be sun. What's that? Boat. Does boat start with B? Hmm. Boat. Boat. Does boat start with B? Yeah. Mm hmm. Circle it. Wow. What's that? Bunny. Mm -mm. What's that? R. What does R say? R. R. Mm-hmm. Rabbit. Say rabbit. Rabbit. Mm -hmm. Which one of these things start with R? Uh, that. What is it? It's a. Uh, it's a. Uh, you can't guess, Mari. What is that? What do you think it is? Hmm. Well, you said it start with R. You must know what it is. Fox. Mm mm. Raccoon. Raccoon. Ruh, ruh, raccoon. Raccoon starts with R? Yeah. Circle it. That. Rainbow. Does rainbow start with R? Mm. Ruh, rainbow. Yes. Good. The little cues. Trace that. This cue for quail. A quail is a kind of bird, okay? It's a quail. Is that quail? Quail. What's that? Uh. That's yarn. Yarn. So you need to write a Y here. Y? Mm-hmm. That Y. That's not a Y. What has she got like that? Good morning. What about that? What's that? K. Good. It starts with C. Write your C. Good job. Now what I want you to do, I want you to write your name up here, okay? Write your name. Uh-uh, not backwards. Yay. Good job, Mari. You're such a big girl. You my big smart girl. You yeah. smart? Yeah. Mm. 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 Look at Kayan, she's asleep. Aww. Yay. Mm. Yeah. You can go play now. Aww. Oh, happy kids. Finally, I'm all done. I'm tired. It is hot in here. It's late to day. It's hot.
see you get a lot I see you big head boy. I see you get a lot I see you big head boy. Open your mouth. Open your mouth. Mm -mm. I'm trying to see your hair. Ooh. Don't worry. So cute. I'm just trying to make this kitchen neat because we. Yeah, I know. This floor needs to be neat. What in the world happened here? Mm -mm. Oh, my God, I got a cute Why do you keep sniffing? You got that from your siblings, I see. Look at the cute little Lonnie hair. Hi. How you do? Mama, uh, maybe clean. Look at the adorable little Mari hair. Say about your hair. My hair is so pretty. <laughs> what else? And, and, and she made my hair curly. Oh, your hair is already curly. Your hair is always curly. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're so cute. <laughs> Bye, YouTube. Wave. Bye, YouTube. <laughs>